Hello to all my friends out there. So it's about time for a tea party again. So I'm excited because one of the followers mentioned she was having pimento and cheese sandwiches and peach tea. And I thought, oh, wow, that sounds good. So I'm having the same thing. What I have is I have bread, mayonnaise, mustard, and I use my uh, cheese. I know this is the way people usually make them, but you know, I want to use my uh, stockpile. But I also want to have a nice little tea party. So today I went to Walmart and I bought this little jar of pimentos. That's why I went there. And I picked up the other stuff, you know, while I was there. And I'm glad I picked that stuff up. So uh, these will be some good little grilled cheese sandwiches. Yummy. Heavy on the pimentos, heavy on the cheese. So when I started this, uh, I was hoping to get some recipes from the followers, but I wasn't expecting things to turn out quite this great. Okay, I bought this bread marked down, 99 cent only at the uh, top of Fletcher Parkway. So this is really cheap. Uh, the cheapest place to buy this cheese, I got a hurry on this. Okay, so I have, I like mayonnaise and mustard on this particular grilled cheese sandwich. This is going to taste good. Haste makes waste. <laughs> And then I already buttered this side of the bread. With my margarine. These are going to be some good little sandwiches. I have some uh, buttery cooking spray so I can spray a little bit of that on here to get a nice uh, toasty look on, on my sandwiches and it tastes good. I buy it at Dollar Tree. Yummy. Okay, so now. Okay, so. I know some of you are selling eBay and I want to mention something. Okay, about two months ago or a month ago, well, at least four weeks ago, I decided to start selling stuff on eBay and I'm really happy because uh, some of you are doing it and it sounds like it's going well. Okay, so what I did was I wanted to sell clothes. I didn't know what I was doing, so I got this... Um, this um, catalog in the mail and I browsed through it and so um, see this outfit here see how pretty the turquoise looks with the leopard print type thing so one of the things I got a bid on is this really cute leopard print dress I have to be careful with it and it's got a super, super cute uh, skirt longer in the back. And I have a bid on this. And so I priced this at $14.98 because I paid um, $1. So I thought that's good because I will get my money out. My customer will get a good deal and they'll come back for more. And then I also bought this adorable thing. Look at this cuteness little rhinestone cuff, bare shoulder, one shoulder. So this is cute. And I priced that at $14.98. Okay, I wanna show you one other thing, two other things. This is a Banana Republic skirt. And when I, I was watching videos, where are my sandwiches already? And, uh, and it was a guy, and he said, don't even bother buying any other kind of sandwiches. Just, I mean, don't even bother buying another brand. Just buy Banana Republic. And, and I have sold them all. 
And then I bought this. This is a patent leather skirt. But I watched this one video, and the videos are really, really helpful. And, and the guy said, buy skirts and shorts, not jeans. They're cheaper to sell, which is true. I can sell these, uh, send these skirts for about $5. A pair of jeans is going to cost me at least 10 So, you know, the, the shipping uh, makes a big difference. Okay, so I want to cut my little sandwiches in, in tea party sizes. Yummy. Ooh, yummy, yummy. Look at this. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's hot. Ooh, it's very hot. Okay, so. I hope some of you are having tea parties for lunch. So what I'm having is I'm having a pretty big lunch. So, okay, I have my little tea party set up because, you know, it's not hard. It's easy. Thank you, Florence Nightingale. And thank you for buying my watch. And thank you for buying my Chinese jacket. <laughs> thank you very much. I hope you like the jacket. It's really a pretty jacket. It really is. Okay, and so then, so the follower that mentioned the pimento and cheese sandwiches said, have peach tea. Oh, yeah, that sounds really, really good. And somebody asked me if the burner is on back here, you know, where the teapot is. No, it's not. So for peach tea, if it's iced tea, I have uh, lemon and sugar. But if it's hot tea, I have milk and sugar. So peach tea is really, really tasty. So, um, I wanted to mention to you guys, um, so the eBay was going pretty well, and this week I made about $100, so that comes in handy. And over the past four weeks, I bought 52 dresses. So I have quite a few dresses to, um, to post. So, okay, let me get my sandwiches back here. Yummy. I like the bread in the back. So I was glad to see Pink Fairy is back. You know, um, I watch that show every day and it wasn't on and I said to myself, oh no, what happened? But she's back so that's good. Okay, now, okay, now what? Well, I'll show you. Mr. Charles's Top Ramen. This is beef top ramen with Vienna sausages. And somebody said in the comments, somebody said that looks unhealthy. So uh, just to go over it, this channel is for somebody who might not have that much money or might not have enough food to get it th ooh, yummy. through the month. Uh, you know, maybe, you know, you might want to go to a health food channel. This, this is more geared for people who want to make a little extra money. Okay, now, yummy, this is also good. Okay, I just happen to like this, but it's also really good. I keep all my tea. It's also really good if you don't have that much money. And then today I bought chips. Okay, usually for this kind of soup, you would have um, flaming Hot Cheetos, but I like bar See how the Walmart chips are not cracked?
Mmm. I have to get something. Okay, now this is super important for the, the oh no, the top ramen soup. You need lemon. I have lime, but lemon or lime. And this is good. So you're not going to starve out. You're not going to bust the budget. Okay, so now for my tea, I used powder milk and I bought napkins. I was ready to go crazy with no napkins. No uh, full size napkins. Then, you know, uh, I agree. Somebody said they can't stand cheap mayo. Me neither. And I can't stand cheap napkins. I can't enjoy my food. Walmart. What else? Now. Okay, so now. This is good. So I want to thank Mr. Charles for giving up his uh, top ramen recipe. Well, you know, I have followers all over in the world. You never know who might be eating this top ramen. Okay, let me taste one of my sandwiches. Pimento and cheese grilled cheese sandwiches. With mayonnaise and mustard. And then I have top ramen with Vienna sausages. So the top ramen is 18 cents. The Vienna sausages are, um, are uh, 48 cents. I bought the bread on Markdown, so then I said, wow, I'm having a tea party. I want some decent cookies. So I went to Smart and Final and I bought brownies, Markdown, one half price. You know, once you start uh, finding a Markdown food, these are some good brownies. I ate quite a few of them on the way home. Let me show you. These are good. And then I bought a package. Okay, so what happened was the, the cookies were fine, but the one on the bottom was cracked. So, you know, I ate the cracked ones. So I have really good cookies to go with my, my peach tea. So, okay. Thank you guys very much for, um, you know, the comments. Look at these awesome comments. You guys read the comments. And um, I hope you guys try this. The, the Walmart chips are good. Okay, you guys, God bless you all, and please like and subscribe and share, and God bless you all.